Hi, uh, board of uh, 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 directors. I uh, just uh, guess I was supposed to talk to you guys about how things have changed for me during the uh, pandemic. Uh, uh, well, I mean, really, not much has changed. Obviously, with the computers and stuff. So, uh, yeah, that's uh, I'm able to to like uh, connect with people, and uh, it's pretty cool. So I can kind of like help them live and stuff. Just uh, sorry, I'm just messaging a student right now, and uh, pretty much everything's the same though. Um, like, uh, well, just come with me, and I'll, I'll, I'll kind of show you some of the things I'm doing with, uh, with teaching. Just a second. Uh, right. Can't touch that. Uh, okay. Yeah. So, but really, like everything's smooth. Everything's good. Like this is really good. I like what we're doing here. And uh, I mean, my teaching is more effective, I find. I have a lot more time for things that I didn't before. And um, anyways, I guess, uh, I guess I'm pretty good at um, teaching and stuff. But uh, just follow me and go. Well, like I said, I mean, there's a couple of dots and stuff. But I mean, that's pretty straightforward. Uh, got to grab some coffee. That's not changed, obviously. Um, there we go. You can probably hear me better now. But um, just having these laptops has been a real blessing. I've been able to stare at a screen much longer than I have been able to in the past without getting a headache. It is quite incredible. Getting coffees and stuff, I mean, that's the cat's pajamas as it always was. I'm really blessed. So even have the cafeteria and stuff, I've got my directions, and uh, it's I can read better than I've ever been able to read before. So. Cheers to that. Nothing's really changed though. Let's finish that off and we'll get a coffee. Whoops. Sorry. That's it. So, what do you guys think about having class outside? I like it. I, you don't have to wear a mask, so... I can lie down. Yeah, it's... I do this all the time. Hi, Demi. Study hall is still happening as usual, even in the COVID times. Generous donors donate two nets to be used outside. This gives the kids a chance to get outside, have some fresh air. They don't have to wear their masks outside. They want to be safe while they're playing basketball. One of the things that we've had to consider as a result of all the restrictions is how we're going to do our regular Bible and chapel programs. And I think one of the great things that's come out of it is that we've been moved into smaller groups. And so our chapels and our Bible classes are happening in groups of about six to ten students. I'm really excited about what we're doing for our Bible classes this year. Uh, because every single student in the school, online and in person, is going through the Gospel of Mark. We're using a method called the Discovery Bible Study Method, and it's a really great way to engage students in a small group setting uh, in going through Scripture. The other thing I love about it is it's equipping them uh, to read Scripture on their own. It's giving them a way to approach Scripture and to dig deeply into the Word of God. One of the other advantages of having small groups is that because we're not able to meet as a whole school in the gym for chapel, 
Uh, we've been able to try some new things in chapel. For example, this year we're going through the Alpha Youth Series with the entire school. And so for those chapel days, the students meet in their small groups. And one of the really cool things about that opportunity is that it's completely student-led. And so student leaders are being raised up to lead their Alpha Group discussions as they dig into topics such as who is God? What is the meaning of life? Who is Jesus? Why did he have to die for us? And so the teachers will just come in and start the video, and then the students take it from there, leading their small Alpha Groups. Hey, everybody. I'm speaking to you here from the space where we broadcast our chapels to the school every Wednesday and also to our students who are online. As you can see, this is also our storage room. 